Hi there, I'm Marie. Today we'll be making a mala sauce. In Mandarin Chinese, it's called mala jiang. It's the base sauce for most Sichuan dishes. Mala means numbing and spicy. After tasting the sauce, it leaves you with a tingling, numbing sensation in your mouth. Besides the spiciness, Homemade mala sauce also has rich layers of other aromatic flavors. Now let's go over the ingredients. This recipe makes two and a half cups of concentrated mala sauce. Sichuan peppercorns and red chili flakes are the main ingredients. You may use any hot pepper variety. I'm adding other spices to enhance flavors and aromas to the sauce. These are fennel seeds, star anise, and dry bay leaves. You may substitute with other spices if you like. Try to limit them to just two or three though. We'll use one teaspoon of salt. Put all the ingredients into a bowl. By the way, the heat level of spiciness for this recipe is about medium. If you like a higher heat level, increase the amount of ingredients according to your own taste. We'll need 2 cups of vegetable oil. Use oil that has a high smoke point. I recommend peanut or canola oil. Heat the oil to 350 degrees Fahrenheit or 177 Celsius. This is the same temperature you use for deep frying. An easy way to measure the temperature without a thermometer is to submerge a moisture chopstick into the oil. If you see bubbles form around the chopstick, your oil is hot enough to use. Pour the hot oil into the spices immediately. Here the sizzle. Suddenly, my kitchen smells terrific. When it has cooled down, transfer the sauce to a glass jar. With its airtight lid on, it will stay fresh inside your refrigerator for up to 12 months. In my next video, I'll be making a Sichuan stir-fry called Ma La Xiang Guo using this sauce. If you like spicy food, be sure you don't miss it. Until then, bye!